Welcome to Imperial CAD system. In this video, I'll explain the option Universal Joint in CATIA V5 DMU Kinematics. See here, I opened Universal Coupling Assembly. Here you can see Universal Coupling connected to shafts both sides and shaft has support. So first To apply this universal joint, go into first fixed part, select new mechanism option, go for OK. Then I select this support. Then, before using this universal joint option, we need to apply two revolute joints, one rigid joint. After that, we apply universal joint for this coupling. So first, I apply rigid joint. I go for rigid joint. These two parts, part 1, part 2, I keep rigid. Then, revolute joint. Select fork cylindrical axis and this support cylindrical axis and plane one. I select this surface and this surface. I keep offset. I need this this distance angle driven and I go for OK. Now revolute joint is applied between these two parts. Then come this side going to revolute joint here again this axis on support and this fork axis cylindrical axis then plane 1 I select this surface and plane 2 I select this surface and I maintain the distance then go for ok then now go for UC joint. Spin one. I select same fork cylindrical axis. Spin two. Then go for OK. Now here you can see here a window showing mechanism can be simulated. Now it simulates. Now we check going into simulation option, go to DMU generic animation, go to simulation, I move this bar, see only that both fork are rotating and center block inside pin collar remains constant, see fork this fork universal coupling fork it should rotate along with the central block pin everything so for that what we need to do is go for dress up option here mechanism dress up new dress up select that mechanism one which we have created then you can see all the parts in this part 1.2 Part 1.2 means uh, this is the first part. This one, see here you can see in specification tree part 01.2 means this one. This is a fork. You have to select that option, that, that part in this. Then see here all these parts. Uh, see pin collar everything see here collar all these uh, parts uh, here you can see shaft also i want to include this shafts also while simulating this shaft center block pin collar everything need to rotate then select all the parts then move to this side product attached to the link 
then go for okay then as this part simulate along with this all the parts which we have moved to this side also simulates then go for okay now we go to simulation option mechanism select that mechanism then go for okay now say i rotate to 360 now you can see here shaft everything is rotating then go to insert then this nothing but uh, reducing speed then go for play see like this to rotate continuously you have change the loop then slightly i increase speed play see like clockwise and anti clockwise continuously it has to rotate in one direction see another again i selected this loop option now continuously it rotates except these supports which we kept rigid remaining all is rotating so like this you need to apply universal joint simulation to this assembly now all the mechanisms all the mechanism saved here in application open this you can see here joints four joints i minimize this here we can see simulation again if you want to simulate double click on that reduce the speed change loop then go for play like this we need to use this option thank you for watching this video for more video share and subscribe imperial cat system